I've had some luck buying groups of uh, beat up comics on eBay. Sometimes they're better than others. Uh, this time, well, you be the judge. Hello. Back again with a stack of uh, really rag comic books that I got on eBay for 20 bucks. Uh, you can see it's a nice little stack, but they're a little bit worse than I was anticipating. But uh, let's go through them here. I've got uh, Black Hawk number 215 with uh, its artwork by uh, Dick Dillon, I think, and uh, Chuck Sidera on inks. Yeah, that's a rag. And uh, Walt Disney's Davy Crockett and a great boat race. Whew, even worse. And a uh, coverless scamp. Disney book. Uh, this was one of the reasons that I picked it up. Ben-Hur by Russ Manning. Kind of nice. And Lost in Space. Not sure who did the art on that. Could be Dan Spiegel, maybe. Space Family Robinson. Yeah, I think that's definitely Dan Spiegel. Some pretty cool stuff. And, you know, I don't mind coverless books. There's A Life with Archie. Voyage to the Deep. That's Sam Glansman. Little Dot. He had this kind of covered up. I should have realized that the cover would be totally messed up. But it's a Warren Kramer cover, such as it is. And I like Little Dot. And there's a beat up Baby Huey, coverless. Where Monsters Dwell, number 19. Let's see what's in there. There's some Kirby. Looks like more Kirby. And Ditko. Voyage to the Bottom of the Sea. I want to say that's George Tusca in uh, Alberto Giolatti, Giolitti on inks. Not bad. There's a jug head. Oh, that feels real light. Sam Schwartz. And there's a Tarzan by Russ Manning. And really beat up Archie. TV laugh out. Probably got Sabrina. Yeah, Sabrina and the Archies. And Wild Wild West.
Or it's not bad in that. I think, if I recall correctly, that's Jose Delbo. Probably South Trapini on inks. And <clears throat> F Troop. Not sure who that is. Star Spangled War Stories with the Dinosaur Story. That's some Joe Kubert. Pterodactyles versus Army Men. And that's uh, Strange Adventures. That is that looks like Mike Sikowski. <clears throat> and that's Murphy Anderson. Army at War, Sergeant Rock. I already got a copy of that, but the cover was messed up. This one, at least the cover is fit halfway decent. It's uh, Qbert. <clears throat> and there's Superboy. I want to say that's George Papp. <clears throat> Boltonov, Varsity Vic. Yeah, that's George Papp. And Army at War. Joe Kubert. Probably Jack Abel in the back. Josie and the Pussycats. Looks like, uh, it's more like Scooby Doo. <clears throat> Kurt Swan. Looks like a Swanderson cover. I'd say that's Al Plastino. Kurt Swan in the back. Japan goes to war. Yeah, that's Kurt Swan. And Challengers of the Unknown. sure who that is. Bob Brown, maybe. And Action Comics. Looks like Kurt Swan on the cover. Immortal Superman. I think that's Kurt Swan. Legion of Superheroes. Must be Wynn Mortimer on that. Yeah, something to read anyway. And this was another one I was interested in. 
the strange adventures. It's not as bad as some. Look at that, Gil Kane. The threat of the faceless creature. Yeah, I like Gil Kane. Danger in Detroit. Looks like Murphy Anderson. And Adele War Combat War Stories. I'm sure that's Sam Glansman. I think I've got that copy. I think I got a copy of this already. And this is uh, Zorro by Alex Toth. It's in a bag. Maybe it's in better shape. I've got a copy of that already. And finally, Donald Duck and the Golden Helmet. A Barks comic. Looks like it's in maybe a two. Well, what do you think of my $20 rag pile buy, buy on eBay? Not that impressive. But uh, if you like it, like it and comment. Tell me what you think.